Okay, I promised you guys I was gonna do a live cop on Friday, and then I never uploaded any live cop. Well, I still did record one. I just didn't do a face cam or anything. And I basically just decided to touch nice. tips with my palace unboxing and this live cop. So let's just start off the live cop. So we're just waiting around for the website to go live. Oh my God, here it is. Uh, so we're gonna have to make our way through these disgusting collab items to get right on over to those flannels, man. Y'all know what I was going for today. Um, so yeah, I did end up grabbing both of these flannels. I don't know which one I like more. You let me know, blue or red. Personally, man, like y'all see I got the blue palace flannel that you're gonna see later in this video. I think I like red more, but we get the face warmer as well. Um, and we also had some like stickers and a pin already in our cart because this guy loves wasting money, man. So uh, yeah, we just fly through checkout. I don't know, the rest is me just checking out, putting in my info, all that fun stuff. Um, but finally we make our way through and there it is voila I don't know which of these two flannels I'm going to keep I'll probably sell the other however I think both of them are gorgeous man I actually think they both will have some profit too so yeah this was the little live cop I recorded let's get into the unboxing hey let's go man we just got the pack look at this box bro this is probably like the biggest box I think I've ever gotten from palace we've been going pretty hard on this palace content lately I hope you guys have been enjoying it just in general man I've been trying to really come at YouTube with a lot of energy recently ever since that person in my family just passed away I've been trying to like use it as motivation you know turn it into something positive where it's like we only got so many days to open these bricks on this earth fellas so you might as well make the most of it while you can let's not get corny though let's get into this damn box i'm so excited if you guys cannot tell so here we go man hey let me know if you guys got anything from week one from palace as well oh we got a lot of goodies inside i'm so excited man let's get started i'm not playing any games today you guys we're going right to the goodies like these are some of my favorite items palace has dropped in a very long time starting it off we have this white knit zip up please fit me oh it looks like it's gonna fit bodaciously fellas let's go bro yo this does feel crazy nice you got just knit paneling all over i don't know how they made these colors work but they somehow did and you flip it to the back side and it's just like stop playing games with me please bro the red color i didn't even know this was red on the back let's put it on bro i'm so excited let's go i do wish that they used a different zipper like supreme i gotta give it to them on the knit zips they always have some really cool zippers now i will say my outfit probably is not gonna match this at all okay this zipper is fucking annoying i'm not gonna lie bro come on please let me zip this up all right i'm not even gonna lie to you guys i'm struggling with this zipper so badly bro please oh here we go here we go fellas it's happening it looks like it actually fits me pretty nicely, man. I will say I'm so not used to rocking natural colorway items. Like, I usually avoid this color, but the prints going on were too bodacious for this one. I kind of think I need a different outfit to, like, truly let this item shine right now because the black hat is not doing it. This is definitely loud as fuck. I don't know how. Let me go look in the mirror, bro. I'm feeling self-conscious in this shit. This is definitely an item I'm not used to rocking. I'm, I'm gonna have to let this one grow on me a little bit. This is kind of one of those items I need to get a haircut cut before I can truly assess it because I don't know it doesn't look good with the hat and everything a cool first pickup though these did sell out on the website I was telling fools like these might even have some resale with them man definitely nothing right away but items like that you look back on with palace and all of a sudden they have like 50 100 dollar profit just because they'll never make anything similar to that again let's keep it moving though um I actually have my pins right here so let's just break into these two here is the p3d pin this thing is a glorious man like y'all know pin collector boon y'all wouldn't know i'm a pin collector because i never actually make any pin collection videos but i do have a ridiculous amount of palace supreme ftp pins i need to do a pin video i promise one day you will see that video one day maybe the same day your dad comes back from the store oh! uh, here we have the lucky charm one i don't even know what this one's actually called the little trifer clover i don't know why i called it lucky charm um pretty cool pins though this p3d is just like <laughs> Stop it. But next up, oh baby. Oh yes, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We got the high kick palace hats. I definitely need to throw one of these on. I've been learning, man. I do not look good in brown hats. I don't know what the fuck it is, but I want to rock this brown one so badly, but we're going to have to do it to him with the black colorway. Am I the only person that feels like some hat colors they just simply cannot do? Because like white hats and brown hats, I have learned. I just, it's not a go. Ooh, but this is, man. Oh my Lord. 
The embroidery count on this Shiba right now is absolutely too damn high. Like, bro, I'm talking yin, yang, gang. Stop playing, bro. This is probably hat of this season. <laughs> to be fair, there's like four hats all season. But I do got to put this one on. Um, I will say the only disappointment of this hat for me is it's not a strap back. It's kind of surprising. I thought it would be. I don't know why they didn't, to be honest. Like, if you're going to do this much embroidery, at least throw, like, a little leather strap on it. But, all right, I'll stop complaining. And here it is on my head. I Hopefully, it looks cute as hell, boys. I barely can see it, so I have no idea how this fits. You guys are either roasting me so meanly in the comments, or you guys are like, oh, it actually looks pretty cool. I love it, bro. It feels like it fits me perfectly. Um, I also do hate that they have the green bottoms on, like, every palace hat. But, yeah, this hat looks like it's pretty fucking sick. I'm actually so excited. Usually, palace hats fit me pretty bad this one fits me like perfect you guys are definitely gonna see me rocking this all season potentially even at my funeral at this point bro like i'll die in this fucking hat why not so next up we're gonna open up another box we have well first i gotta show you guys the stickers we got um this is honestly one of the better sticker packs i think i've ever seen from palace like there's a lot of hitters in here starting it off with the clover we got the sickle and hammer communist little palace sticker this just dropped today the knit sweater um, this is probably like the weakest one in my opinion. This little just pee. Hopefully you guys are seeing that. This is a pretty sexy one. I, I gotta give it to him, man. The bubbles and shit, pretty sick. As always, we just have some colored trifurgs. The light blue, actually pretty cool. Purple as well. These are actually really dope. I like those. We got the mosh pit fucking narcissist tour, bro. If you guys have seen videos from that tour, dudes be dying in the pits. And oh, oh man, this is where we're starting to get in the heavy hitters. The Einstein going crazy yo this one is so this is such a good sticker pack bop we got the akira little mock shirt and then finally um the little soccer pit bull thing another design i really like this season what a good sticker pack but we gotta hop into the main feature of that box and it is this little palace mug oh i love this man i absolutely love it on the inside it says don't be a mug that's actually kind of funny palace on the bottom Yes, sir, man. I love this one. I actually have like a little mug collection going on. This is going to look so appropriate with the rest of them. Another item that sold out, I told people, would probably have like double retailers. So this was only like 18 bucks. As somebody that's bought a bunch of mugs off of these different brands, man, this is probably one of the cheaper mug prices I've seen. So respect for that palace. Like literally speaking of like cool mugs, here's another one. This is the one I'm sipping my espresso out of. A little Beavis and Butthead vintage one. I don't know, bro. It's kind of fun to collect mugs. There's a bunch of cool ones out there. But it's time to hop into maybe my favorite item of this whole drop, and it has to be the flannel, man. I absolutely adored these flannels. I actually have a super old palace flannel right here next to me. This one's for sale on Seattle Select. I love their flannels, man. And honestly, they haven't done many cool flannels in a long time. This one was sick. I've had this one for fucking ever. XL, if you guys want it, go check my web store if you guys want to cop that one. But um, let's throw this on, man. First off, I'll give you guys like an up close of the print. We got the orange triferg, nice like yellow kind of brownish hints along with the blue. And I did go with the size medium. I think it's gonna fit perfect, but I'll let you guys know. Here we have it, man, the palace flannel. Hey, I hope you guys like it as much as I do. The other colors for this, are also pretty hard this was my favorite partially because um, I just don't have this color flannel really in my closet but here we got it the palace flannel our final pickup from week one we just got some more flannels today thankfully I went size medium on those as well I'd say if anything these fit a little bit big but medium fits me just about perfect but that's gonna do it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed the pickups a lot of cool ones today honestly I was so excited about this drop I still am gonna have to find a way to rock this knit because this is one of the louder like color the ways I think I've bought in a long ass time. We'll see though. I gotta get a haircut first before I truly decide if I like this knit or not. But let me take it off. I look dorky with both of them on. That's gonna do it though. It's been your boy Boone. I hope you guys did enjoy. Also, man, we got the little like a little something over here on the side, a little clothing rack. I'm definitely just trying to spice up this room for you guys. Next up, I might be reorganizing these shelves because they really desperately need it. But I'm just rambling at this point. Drop a like, you guys want more palace videos. I've been trying to go hard with them. I appreciate you guys all for watching. It's been your boy Boone. Um, yeah, man, dope pickups. Um, this hat, probably my favorite. I absolutely love this. Anyway, I'm out. Peace.